Hey, what's up, guys? Happy Memorial Day. JD Venom here, back with you for another Call of Duty Black Ops 3 daily gameplay video and commentaries here. If you guys are new around here, please rate, subscribe, drop a comment. Follow me on Twitter and like the Facebook page, where both links are down below. Tell your friends and tell your family and come and join the JD Venom Nation here on YouTube. In today's gameplay commentary, I want to talk about... This particular optical sight that I use, I don't use much optical sights. I'm pretty sure this is nothing new uh, to you guys that have known about this. Um, about this particular optical sight that it pr generally pretty much gives you non-recoil on your weapons. It is significantly, you know, um, makes your gun more stable when you shoot your gun. And that is the recon sight. Putting this on any gun in the game pretty much makes your your you know your recoil your recoil patterns a lot more easier to, to control. But a good thing about the recon sight is that I don't usually use uh, optic sights. Usually when I use optic sights, just a regular red dot. But I'll tell you what, I'm probably gonna start using more recon uh, sights in my guns for you know maybe future Call of Duty if, if they keep it up with the whole you know it, you know helps you with your recoil on certain weapons. Because, I, I'll tell you what, like, at the beginning of my Call of Duty life, I should say, when I, was, when I very first played, um, Modern Warfare, uh, 4, 4, not Modern Warfare 4, but Call of Duty 4, Modern Warfare on the 360, I used to use the Mini Uzi with the ACOG sight, which is pretty much the recon, and that's what it is, it's, it's an ACOG sight. But nevertheless, though, I mean, I haven't really used much of this particular sight at all, Probably until this game here. Um, this one here is uh, very, very good. Very, very good. And it's very easy to control. It doesn't really uh, blind your sights as well. Like, you do, I mean, you do get a little bit of optical, um, you know, a little bit of optical illusionist when you do use the sight. But overall, I think, I say, I think it's a good sight. I really think it's a good sight uh, just because of the fact that you, it's so versatile on most weapons. I mean, I believe on all classes with the exception of shotguns and like the pistols and things of that nature, you can put a recon sight on. So you can put a recon sight on the submachine guns, uh, of course, uh, assault rifles, light, you know, light machine guns, and even sniper rifles as well. You know, shotguns is not one of them. Pistols is not one of them. Of course, the rocket launchers and, you know, the other weapons like that are not one of them, but... I would like to use the recon sight on probably more like semi-automatics and burst fire weapons. I think they weren't the best on those in my personal opinion. Even though I am using a fully automatic submachine gun here, um, I wouldn't personally use a recon on a submachine gun unless it's your type of game style where, you, where you're where you kind of like far away from your opponent saying you want to get some distance away from them. Then I'll go with the recon sight. But like if you're playing something like I don't know, like Newtown, and you're looking at the fairways or something like that, uh, on Newtown, the uh, alleyways. Yeah, put this on a Shiva, put this on, you know, an M8A7 or, or an XR2, and go to town with it. Because, I mean, this this site here, like I said, it gives you non-recoil. But if anything, instead of the recon site, I'll probably use the barracks, because the barracks is out the more versatile, because you can change it to a regular... Um, Recon side, or you can have it as a regular red dot side. You can zoom in and out, and it, I believe it has the same uh, recoil patterns, the same uh, multipliers on there for the recoil patterns on that particular side. But let me know about the recon side. Do y'all use it? Do y'all use the barrack site? Uh, do y'all use the regular site? Uh, let me know what you use. Um, but yeah, the recon site is very, very useful, guys, and I will highly recommend using it. Um, if that, if not that, at least the uh, barracks, because like I say, you get to zoom in and out. But uh, some people don't like to actually try to use the zoom. They don't like to click the, the right thumbstick for whatever reason, which makes no sense to me because it's a lot more easier. But uh, guys, I am gonna go and get out of here. Tell me no. Ooh, tell me no. What, what does that mean? Tell me no. That makes no sense. Let me know what you think about this. And I hope everybody out there is having a good Memorial Day. Um, tonight, I'm not gonna be doing any streams or anything. I will be watching Monday Night Raw and seeing how the new. Um, uh, how they're gonna start training the new uh, brand splits? I know we're not the the, the brand splits not coming until July nineteenth, but don't talk about that too too much. Um, I have a I have a uh, wrestling channel that I can talk about that on 
on Venom Nation Wrestling if you guys want to subscribe to that. But guys, I am going to go and get out of here. Please rate, please subscribe, please drop a comment. And you guys enjoy your Memorial Day. Have some barbecue, have some fun, play some baseball, play some basketball. Have fun with your friends and family. But you guys have a great day. Peace out.